Hello everybody and welcome to another unboxing video. Today I'm doing something a little bit different. This is actually my first 1 6th Mega Hall from Modeler's Loft. I discovered them online and they've pretty much got everything from the vintage Action Man line all the way through to the modern Dragon in Dreams, including things like hot toys and they even do tanks. So I got myself some toys. Sorry about the lighting, this box is just too big, even for my studio. -hoo -hoo -hoo! We've got some nice goodies in here. Let's uh, open this up. Right, got lots of uh, lots of pieces of polystyrene and that in here to pad it all out as well. Uh, first things first. Ah, got the uh, special edition of the second armored division donald that is of course brad pitt from fury i'm building up a fury that's why i was looking at the tanks as well and i've got the 3q head to review as well so looking at changing that over but oh, there's a lot of weight to that that's a very heavy piece next up we have the man himself i have a dream the Martin Luther King. This is the January 15th, 1929 to April 4th, 1968 commemorative set. And there we go. That's a very nice set. March on Washington for jobs and freedom. And we have got the Russian sniper. That is, of course, Ron Perlman. This is the DID 12th anniversary edition comes with that set there you get a lot in there a lot included and again there's a lot of heft in this set next up i have a dog i have a dog now why would you think i would get a british bulldog one sixth scale collectible i'll tell you why because i got this man <laughs> I got Sir Winston Churchill, Prime Minister of the United Kingdom. I got his set. Looks fantastic. Again, a lot of heft to that. And last but not least, I have the I Have a Dream stand that goes with Martin Luther King. This is so he could do the speech and he has a copy of the Bible on there. So there we have it, ladies and gentlemen. That's not a bad haul, is it, as far as one sixth scale figures go? I think I've done okay. Uh, it's stuck with the Dragon in Dreams line. You don't see hardly anything of them on YouTube when you search. You see their young Robert De Niro and you also see their Johnny Depp, but you don't really see much else. I believe it was the Clipper King. He shoo off his Churchill. And I just looked into the Dragon in Dreams just a little bit more and I was amazed that they didn't have more coverage because as far as accuracy goes, they are outstanding. I mean, the second Armour Division Hell on Wheels Sergeant Donald, it bears a resemblance to Brad Pitt, but it's not the face I was going for. The uniform is absolutely stunning. It is spot on. But... Getting him then makes me want to get the rest of the crew. I have to get like Shia LaBeouf and then I have to find a tank. I mean, they exist. One sixth scale tanks actually exist, um, but they don't do the exact one from Fury. They do an M4, uh, but that's about it. That's the closest I'm going to get. Really like the look of Martin Luther King. He looks fantastic. And I mean, he's one of the most amazing people in our present history. Winston Churchill goes without saying. And I got Ron Perlman because it's Ron Perlman and I love him. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you found this unboxing fun and insightful. And let me know in the description which one of these you would like me to review first. And, and don't say the dog. Until next time, thanks for watching and goodbye.